DK Star. DK. Donkey Kong. Have I talked about King K. Rool and Smash yet? And how I'm just super happy about it? Because if not, I'm super happy about it. I just really like the Donkey Kong universe and stuff. I'm gonna try to avoid talking about like the Smash stuff because like I said, I'm considering making a video about it. So I don't want to talk about it too much. And wow, you went ahead and hold three spaces. And I got DK. You actually get to see DK uh, move around a bit. And he just positions himself for the warp pipe, which is kind of cool. Off camera secrets they don't get to see otherwise. And he loses a coin. Very good use of your warp pipe. Uh, we're gonna not use our Mega Mushroom because this thing right here is what's gonna get us out of here. Welcome to the Dice Duel. Let's play a dice game. Roll higher than me, you win 10 coins. Roll lower than me, and you get back to start. So, this is a situation in which I would actually want to lose just so I could get the heck out of here. Uh, if he gets a 10, then he automatically wins, but uh, it looks like I might win this. Oh, hooray! I lose! And it's not even Tuesday. Wait, maybe that means I do lose? I don't remember how that game works. It was just really confusing. Seven, six, five, four, three. Oh, Magic Lamp is also a really good uh, thing to have in this uh, board because it gets you to the star space without having to play the stupid lottery thing. Chomp Call, though, it's a new item we uh, haven't seen before. It lets you move the star space, which is very convenient, especially for a board like this. I don't think it's exclusive to this board, though. Uh, no, it's, an, it's available in every board, basically. Still don't really want any of these things, so I'll just get out of here. Mew. I like that they have different sound effects. I always like the uh, Goomba and Shy Guy sound effects in the Koopa one. They're just all really cool sounding. They get changed up a bit in later games. It kind of makes me annoyed and stuff. All the little minor things that only I care about and nobody else, but whatevs. Yoshi's gonna get whole zero coins out of Waluigi because he's got no coins. But he got a 15. Hopefully that means a lot to you, Yoshi. Where the heck is he going? Oh, those happening spaces up there, those will allow you to go between the- Oh, I guess they could have gone to the purple zone. Uh, it allows you to skip over to the other side. Grey Showman reference. Also, speaking of Grey Showman, can we talk about how many- uh, how much Grey Showman appreciation of AGT has been getting? Like, America's Got Talent has been really good this year, and so many sing Grey Showman songs. I feel like if I wasn't a fan of the Grey Showman, I'd be kind of annoyed at the lack of variety, but I just love that stinking movie so stinking much, so I'm okay with it. I still want a real life version of these things. I don't know what you call it. Uh, just a floaty. A plomp floaty. And I just realized I was on Yoshi's side. I was just sort of mashing A without really seeing where I was, who I was. When will my reflection show who I am inside? Ooh, that was a good little synchronized jump he did right there. Yeah, good job, Yoshi. You got that ground pound all up and dandy. And we're good. Wish it was that easy to deflate floaties in real life or something like that, I don't know. Uh, sometimes it is, like, what is it with, like, the floaties? Sometimes, like, you just release the thingy. I like this is the discussion I'm having. What's the deal with floaties? <laughs> What's, like, some of them, you just take the little popper off, and then it deflates immediately, but the other ones, like, it just will not deflate, no matter what. And it's just, like, you're stuck with this big stinking object, you don't know what to do with it. Uh, was that a warp pipe? I think it was a warp pipe. Uh, I just got sent back to start, so that's- Oh, that was good for him, not me. How lame! Uh, he gets a four, but then again, I could use the happening spaces up there to my advantage if I'm lucky enough. Uh, let's see, Donkey Kong's going to not pay any money, and he is going to... Beep, 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 beep. The red space, hooray! It'd be funny if I actually got a red space, nah, it's a blue space. But he's not any closer to the star than I am, sorta, of, kinda. Uh, main mushroom. That's actually a good move on Waluigi's part because he's gonna very easily hit that happening space. And he gets a three! Did he miss it? No, he didn't. Goes over there. And let's see how this works. Sits on the little bingo chip. I don't think it's a bingo chip, but whatever. <laughs> yeah, I'm just really singing funny. So you get some coins along the way and you just get to see him roll around on a bingo chip. Or a casino chip. Yeah, I don't know anything about sports or about casino land and stuff. I feel like I talked about this in this LP or whatever. I'm about just from repeating stories. Clearly something that I'm not ever known for doing. But, um, I remember Chris from Visit Mag was trying to teach me how to play... I almost said how trying to teach me how to play casino. No, trying to teach me how to play solitaire or poker or something. And I just... It was in one ear and out the other. I do not remember anything. And hey, that's the first time I've seen a boo house. And of course he's gonna steal from me. I am the ultimate threat because I have more corn than anyone else. Uh, just slap that boo, slap that boo, slap the boo. Unfortunately, it didn't work. Don't you know you gotta punch the boo, Daisy? That's how it works in Mario 64. You can't slap the boo. 
And Yoshiki goes ahead and loses those coins I just gave him. How rude. Uh, 2v2. We got ourselves... Order up! Ooh, this is a fun minigame. Glad we're getting new ones. Toad will order items that you must find in the boxes before the other team. First, three, first to three points wins. Move and open a box. Before the boxes come down, try to memorize the order of items in the circle. So, you see a bunch of food on there, and then it rotates around, you gotta get the items that Toad is looking for. So apologies if I'm super quiet in this one, because I can't talk and look at food at the same time. I guess you could say it's food for thought. You can actually move around during the spiral, which is something that a lot of people actually don't know. They don't, they don't think to do, but it is helpful. Yay, we did it! And up next we got, uh, corn dog, ice cream, burger. Uh, oh! Uh, some burger. Do not know where fries are. Um, yeah, there are the fries. Trying so stinking hard not to go on a McDonald's tangent because I go on one like every stinking LP. This is like a whole row of like all the different things. It's like a corn dog, ice cream. Uh, wait, wait, this one was the ice cream? No, that was the burger. Uh, ice cream? This one was. God darn it. Okay, cool. Donkey Kong got me covered. Hey, DK, don't you know it's no shirt, no shoes, no service? At least he's got a tie. Oh, sad Yoshi. <laughs> so yes, I really don't have any interesting thing to tell you about um, me getting my wisdom tooth out. It was very, very short. I only have one, so I was very kind of lucky in that regard. Uh, I only have one in general and that one need to get taken out. So it was like less than 10 seconds and I don't even... Like there was no part where I was like going under or whatever you want to call it. Just I losing control of my actions or going loopy or anything like that. Uh, they said they used laughing gas, but like it didn't do anything, and then um, they just, I don't know, I, there was no part where I didn't remember anything, anything. like I remember the entire process, and uh, I was expecting it to be kind of painful, but it really worked. So, anyone who's getting Wisdom in 2000 anytime soon, here's your good old midnight seal of approval telling you that it doesn't hurt, and you'll be just fine. Hopefully. <laughs> so we get a three, and hey, Bowser, buddy! Oh, great. So this is the part where I pray for Bowser instead of Koba Kid, because at least I get a fighting chance with Bowser. Oh, Koba Kid, god darn it. I'm one of the Koba Kids. What kind of dastardly deeds can I do today? Gonna take 20 coins from all of you. Hooray! At least it's not just me. Get to share in the suffering. Ha, <laughs> later. Now, there's actually a very rare chance. I don't think we'll be able to see in the LP, but there's a very, very rare chance that Koba Kid will come down and do something, and then he'll be like, What? That wasn't good enough for you? Uh, fine, I'm gonna call my dad over, and then Bowser shows up. So you could sometimes get Koba Kid and Bowser in the same space, which is kind of terrifying. Oh, right or left. I have so many stories to share. God darn it. Um, so I'll get back to the Koba Kid one in a bit, but right or left, I remember when I was trying to do all these things for this mini game, this LP or whatever, trying to go through story mode with every character. I was playing this game and I was in a Skype call with some friends. Uh, you just gotta row the bow with your buddy and not overpower each other and go through the dungeon. But, um, I remember I was playing this and there was just like a lot of button noises. And I remember, uh, Cyrus being like, Jeffrey, you're making a noise! I was like, I'm rowing an oar! And that was the hint for this LP that was on Twitter, so if you're wondering what that was from, then it was this. I think I'm in the red boat. Yeah, I am. So, what was I trying to talk about? So, Koba Kid, when he summons Bowser, he calls him his dad. So, I guess that means they're also father and son, even though they came before Bowser Jr. So, why the fruit does Bowser Jr. get any sort of special treatment? And why is he in, like, every single Mario game since his creation? But stinking Koba Kid just drops off the face of the planet. Like stinking Bowser Jr. is the worst. Like I've gone, mm, I've gone on every tangent. I feel like I'm just out of stories. Maybe I can't make it to 60 more LPs because I've run out of stories. My life is not interesting enough to continue on for 60 more LPs. So I should just retire right here and now. No, we're not doing that. But seriously, Koba Kid is just so much better than Bowser Jr. And I wish he was in Mario Party games to this day. I wish Bowser Jr. would just fall off a cliff, and I wish Daisy was actually seeable in this shot instead of being behind DK's bicep. But whatever, enough complaining. Yeah, who am I kidding? I'm always gonna be complaining. And yes, I know that rowing an oar doesn't make any sense. 
Or does it? I don't know. Is that a sentence? Who knows? English teachers knows, but I don't knows because I'm not English teacher man thing. And the phone's ringing, hooray. <laughs> okay. DK is going to... Has anyone gotten a star yet? Like, my god. Like, this is what I'm talking like, it's not a boring board, it's just that, like, sometimes it can be very eventful, sometimes you get nothing done. So, this seems to be one of those scenarios in which nothing's gonna get done! And as soon as I say that, DK goes to the purple zone. I think Waluigi's in here too, but he's got no money. And DK doesn't have that much money either. Let's see, Waluigi's gonna go get a three! Yeah, three! That's the thing you gonna leave with a mini mushroom. He loses three non-existent coins. He owes Goomba three coins once the game is over. And let's see, can I get a magic lamp so we can just make this a heck of a lot easier? Uh, no, we cannot. Sparky sticker would be interesting. I don't think you get the coins from the opponent that you take from the Sparky sticker, so... I don't think it's worth it. Mini Mega Hammer, we've shown this already. Uh, I guess we're just gonna get out of here. Wish there was some sort of interesting items. Can you get me out of here, Goomba? I very much appreciate it. Let's go! A three. Great. Right. Ten. <laughs> and I get ten coins at least. Increasing my chances of possibly getting a lamp. Increase my chances of being disappointed, I guess. Huh. Huh. Oh, this does take me back to the start. What the fruit? Oh. I forgot that the this is the green squadron. There's a green squadron? I feel like no one ever goes here, so that's why I never think. Yeah, because it's like it's so sick and tiny. So that's kind of funny. I kind of forgot that it even existed. Uh, yeah, why would I not go to Boo? So let's go there. Thankfully, I didn't land on the spring space or the chance time space, but then again, spring would have been helpful this time. Unless it went to Yoshi, which it probably would have done for me. And we get one versus three, finally. Uh, not Candlelight Fright, even though I'm on the, win on the winning team, it is not fun. Making waves. Uh, again, I'm on the supposedly winning team, but I just failed horribly last time. I feel like I was just in a trance last time I was playing this, so it just didn't go over well. So let's try it again, see if I could show off my mad skills. I'm just hiding 10. We're crashing waves, bruh. Uh, let's see. Here, DK. So we do this. Oh, oh, that looks good. That looks good. Just that we shouldn't have DK on the other side because then he bounces things out. Come on, Yoshi, push him over there. Yeah, yeah, get over here. I'm gonna do this and we're just gonna want ground panel all at the same time. Okay, yeah, that was a good one. It's not gonna work, is it? I feel like the one person. Does the one person always win? I feel like. I don't know. Life is hard. I just wanna win this stinking mini game and that's not happening. Water Luigi, wah, wah. Water Luigi's more like it. Yeah, I'm running out of things to say. I can't run out of things to say. It's the beginning of a new day of a new recording session. Come on, Midnight. You gotta be better than that. You're a season LP veteran now. You you can know how to do things. I don't sing it now. I don't know how to do anything. What the heck is wrong? I feel like I'm just like pregnant and confused. <laughs> That's a quote of the day. Hey, Bowser Space. Can we please get stinking Bowser in this LP? I feel like every time I ask for it, it's just not gonna happen. And I predicted the future. Uh, 20 coins from just DK, cool, hooray! Luigi going to number six. Is he also, oh, I thought he also got Bowser, that would've been funny. Trying to get 10 coins or the star, or star with 10 coins? I don't think so, bro. Uh, no one has money. I can't steal from people if you don't have money. What is with all the Bowser today? Jeez, all right. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and steal coins from... Uh, gee, I got so many options. I want DK! I want DK! Well, Luigi. Let's see what we got. The fact that he has a small amount of coins means that we're gonna steal a very small amount. Wah, 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 wah. Or we could steal everything he has. He has a spork. Spork! Just 13 coins? Is that the best you could do? I guess that's how it goes. But that was everything he had. Oh, poor Boo, always an overachiever. Never thinks he's good enough. I believe in you, Boo. I believe in you, her, her, her. Does Bowser like puns? Let's find out! On the next exciting episode of Dragon Ball Z! Come on! Oh, whatever. Go ahead and take coins from everyone, because you're a jerk. Everyone has zero coins except for me. 
I was wondering if like mashing A would make Bowser appear like they could sense you're pressing the A button. He's like, oh, you think I'm not good enough for you? Me, me. It's like in uh, Animal Crossing, if you press the A button rapidly through Rossetti's thing, he actually senses it and he tells you exactly how many times you were pressing the A button. It's really singing funny. Oh, Yoshi got the lucky space. Great. So he gets 20 coins and gets to choose where he gets to go. So tell me, do you want to go to the purple space? Five, four, three, two, one. I still have a chance, guys. I can get over there. No, I can't. I could get a Mega Mushroom, though, and uh, stomp on Yoshi, make him lose the coins before he gets over there, and make it so he can't get the star. I still have a chance, guys! I don't know why I'm so sick and excited. Because I'm having fun. Jeez, I don't know. I was like, I don't know why I'm excited. Why am I having fun when playing this game? Why am I enjoying the things I'm spending my time doing? Isn't it supposed to be the opposite? Like, I'm supposed to be angry with whatever I'm doing? Oh, whatever. Going through Team Treasure Trek again. Star Trek, the next generation. Was that? Oh, I thought I got it. No. I'm on Team Red. Oh, Waluigi's over there. Uh, wherever he is, they don't actually show you the outline on here. But basically, I want to go find the WA. I found the WA, but where is the item he was right next to? That would be right over uh, there. Of course, I went the wrong way. Come on. Uh, who's on my team? Donkey Kong. So. Need to find Donkey Kong again real quick. Uh, there's Donkey- Wait, that was Donkey Kong! I was like, oh, where's Donkey Kong? There's Donkey Kong! Uh, get back out. Okay, we didn't stand a chance. Whoa, slow down! Frame rate! Key unlock for magical corns! It's not just any corn, it's magical corn! 